Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a really fun video, I'm really excited to film this. I was contacted by Quiz Clothing and they offered to send me some pieces. And I thought this would be a really good opportunity for me to come on here and do a first impressions try on with you guys. So just a disclaimer, they did send me over all of these bits but I'm not being paid and I don't have to feel any sort of way about them. I just thought I'd share my first impressions with you guys, especially because they're a brand that I haven't tried before. When are they not doing roadworks near my house? Like when? When are they not building near my house? For me personally, Quiz kind of comes under the same sort of brands as, you know, like Select or like maybe a brand you'd see on the high street, pass, maybe spot something you like in the window, but never really go in and never really commit to it. I think I've been in a Select shop and a Quiz shop maybe once each and I sort of just had a wander around and then I didn't commit to buying anything. So I thought this would be a really good opportunity to try some Quiz clothing because I've never tried any of their clothing on before and also to kind of debunk some myths or prove some myths, I mean we don't know how this is going to go. A lot of people assume that brands like Quiz and Select are super cheap and the quality isn't very good so we're going to go through and have a look at the quality, have a look at the fit and the price because let me tell you when I was actually choosing some bits on the website I was quite surprised at how much everything was in my head. It was more like a Primark style shop where everything's a little bit more on the cheaper side of things but some of the stuff is actually um, like the same price as maybe like New Look or H&M so I am really interested to see what the pieces look like on and whether they're worth the money because these aren't necessarily cheap pieces and that really did surprise me. So let's get straight into it. I should probably check the prices of everything. Okay, let's have a look. Okay, so first up is a bag and when I saw this online I was like, am I on the wrong website? Is this H&M? Is this Mango? Is this Zara? I am confused but I knew I needed to have it. So I picked out this bag. It's like a woven bucket bag with a enamel style handle, like it's like really cute like this. It also comes with a long strap which I've taken off just because it was like hanging in front of the bag. But it does come with a long strap as well and I just thought that it was absolutely adorable. And on the website I did think to myself this would be really hard to pull off in a sort of like a cheaper material because it's a like a woven bucket bag, I hope that makes sense. I'm really impressed and I'm not surprised that I'm impressed because this bag is actually $29.99. So that's the sort of price I would expect to pay for this sort of bag in maybe like Zara. I would expect to pay $29.99 for this bag in Zara. So I mean, it's not expensive at all. So it's the same sort of price you'd pay for a bag in Zara and I do feel like it's the same quality. I am really impressed. So the actual bag itself is really nice and rattan and woven. I think it's really lovely and the enamel handle is made really well. Like the detailing on it is absolutely beautiful. I think the shape of the enamel on the handbag is really pretty as well and then the lining even has like a little tie on the top. It's linen, which I just thought was just a really, really nice touch. It's really nice and big inside. And then all you need to do is just tie it up and you're pretty much good to go. You can wear it as a crossbody or with a little handle. And I just thought that this is just such a lovely bag and I would never expect to see it in somewhere like Quiz. So I am really, really happy with this one. And I am, to be honest, really shocked at the quality. And the design, because I think that the design is really cute, like you just hold it like this and it's like a cute little bucket bag. Yeah, I'm just really impressed from the offset. This is just, like, wow, I love this bag. Okay, so going into this, I decided that I would pick out pieces that I would naturally go for just to give Quiz like the best shot. There's no point in me picking pieces that I know I won't like or won't suit me or like I know I won't vibe with, like I just know, you know, you know when you know. So I decided to pick out something that I knew that if it fit, that I would love. So I picked out a petite, yes they do petite, I'll speak about that in a minute, but this is a petite animal print satin midi wrap dress. And if that isn't meant for me, I don't know what is because this is something that I have from many different stores. It's something that I am, you know when you just buy too much of one thing and they all look the same, this is that for me. I absolutely love wrap dresses in animal print, 
that are satin material. That is my jam through and through. So I thought I'd pick this up because if anything on the website is gonna be like my thing, it's gonna be this. So I'm really excited to try this one. I have real high hopes for it. And um, I'm gonna go try it on and I'll be back in a second. Cut my thumb taking the tag off this dress, but I think it was completely worth it. Oh my God. So this is the dress on and I am really, really impressed. I can't believe that it looks this nice. It has like the elasticated arms and they are a little bit tight, but that might just be me. And it's one of those wrap dresses that is like already wrapped for you. Like this bit is completely wrapped and then you just have to do the tie. Um, some people like that and some people don't. Um, usually I don't, but I actually think this, this wrap was made really, really nicely. I'm wearing a size 10 and I would say it's a true 10. It's got like a zip up the back. I would say that, yeah, it is pretty much a true 10. It's also, I think it's 36 pounds 99. And I do feel like I have other dresses from more expensive brands that do this style of dress. And this one is such a good alternative for like half the price. I think that it looks really cute. It's a really nice petite fit. Like it's not too long. It's like a good midi length on me. To be honest, I'm actually shocked at how much I like this dress. Would I wear it 100%? I'm gonna wear, <laughs> I'm gonna wear it in the summer. It'll look so cute with some trainers, some sandals, some heels. You could do lots of different things with this dress. And I feel like it's made really nicely. It's so flattering. The material feels like quite expensive as well. It does not feel cheap in any sort of way. Like I said before, I have a lot of satin style dresses and the quality on this one is the same quality. I would say it feels like the same quality in terms of the materials. So I think this is a really, really good bargain buy. I'm so happy I got this dress. And you can probably tell by my face, I am beaming. It just makes me feel amazing. I really, really like this one, guys. Oh my God. So you might say, Hall, is there a theme going on here? And yes, yes, there is. Here is another animal print wrap dress. You know what? I really just can't help myself. I had to pick this one up. It is absolutely gorgeous. It has these little ruffles and the bottom is all ruffle. I hope you guys can see that. Like it's all ruffle in the bottom. Green is so in right now. So I just had to pick this one up. Again, it's in the same sort of wrap style that I know I like. So I'm giving this one a really good shot. Um, this one is not petite, however. So I'm gonna give this one a go and I'll be back in a moment. Okay, so this is the second dress on, and I do really like it. I think it's absolutely adorable on. It's a 10, and I would say it's a true 10. I would say that compared to the first dress, um, it, the material isn't the same kind of high quality. It's that sort of chiffon type dress, um, the kind of synthetic chiffon type material, which is fine. I mean, for the price, it's there for $2.99, and I think for the price, like, that's totally fine. I really like the cut and the fit. One thing I would say about this dress is that if you're um, chesty like me, it does have the tendency to pop open. So you might need to like pin it or put like an underlay underneath, like a body or something just to kind of hide some of your chest because it just does keep popping open. But I think with a little pin there, it would be totally fine. Again, it's one of those wrap dresses that does up on its own and you do the tie up. So it doesn't have the most flexibility in like terms of covering everything up. So some of the material gapes a little bit, but I think that's totally fine. But I think a little pin here could just fix that situation. For 32 99 I am not complaining. I think that it looks absolutely adorable. I have noticed one thing that's good for me, but it's probably not good for um, anyone else out there who is taller. But this dress is pretty much a uh, mini fit on me, like a true, true mini fit. I personally wouldn't be comfortable with it going any shorter. So if you are taller than me, and I'm five foot two, so if you're taller than me, this is gonna get real short real quick. And yeah, just maybe keep that in mind. But for me, I'm not complaining. It fits like a proper mini on me. And that's just great. So I'm, Really nicely surprised with this dress. Right, next up is a little cord. So when this arrived, I was actually pleasantly surprised because the material is an actual like woven poplin material. And I think that's absolutely great. Like I love that. I thought it was gonna be more like synthetic maybe like this, but it was a real like linen material, like both pieces. And this one is really nicely ruched. They both have zips as well, which I think is great. They're great touches. And I love that the 
the print is just this cutest, the cutest little lemon print ever. So I'm going to try this one on and I'll be back in a moment, guys. I am well and, well and truly blown away and surprised yet again. Can we just... I have never had a colour that fits me this well. It's actually ridiculous. Um, can we... Can we take a moment? What? I'm so confused. Like, the skirt fits me like an absolute glove. Like, each part of the skirt is like, boom, to my figure. Like, this is a 10. And it just fits, like, so, so nice. It's just so flattering. I don't know what about it. What? I don't know what it is about it, but the, like, the ruching is just so flattering. I'm lost for words. The top itself is really, really nice. At first when I put it on, I did think that it was a bit uh, cheap that you can like use this to ruche it up more or like undo the ruching. It's fixed like this. So even though it has these ties, it's like fixed as this like length in terms of the ruching. But it made up for it in the fact that the straps are adjustable. Like they have the little adjustable like moments on the back which I think is great because I'm sure I needed to adjust it up it's so flattering I did get a 12 in the top and I think that fits perfectly and a 10 in the bottom and they fit perfectly I am blown away and shocked and amazed wow okay I'm just going to check the prices for the cohort because I'm pretty sure you have to buy them separately yeah okay so the top is 15 pounds 15 pounds and the bottom is 18 pounds so all in all, it's just over £30 for the set, and yeah, I think that's worth it. £30 for this cohort? No, I mean, come on. Wow, I just didn't think this was going to go this way, but here we are. Right, so next up are two pieces that I'm going to try on together. So I got them because I had them in mind to like pair them, so I'm going to try them on together. And the first piece is this lovely little shirt top with ruffles, and they've got like the tie sides up at the top. And then I spotted petite wide leg trousers. So like holding them up to me, they still look pretty long, so I'm not sure how petite they're going to be. They also look like they're going to be pretty see-through because you can see the tag. I don't know if you guys can see that you can like literally like read the writing on the tag through the trousers so I don't have too like high hopes for the trousers but I feel like the top I hope it fits because it is just the cutest little top so I'm gonna give these a try on now and I'll be back in a moment mixed feelings guys mixed feelings right okay so the top let's start with the top I love it it's adorable I want to check how much it is because I have a feeling that it was an absolute bargain it's just the prettiest sage top and it's so flattering. $9.99, it's in the sale at the moment for $9.99. And yeah, I absolutely love it. This is something I would get so much wear out of. I love the fact that it's got these kind of tie sleeves. I just think it adds a little different kind of dimension to the top and makes it look more expensive. I love the ruffle. I just think it's so cute, so flattering as well. So it doesn't kind of cover the figure hugging part of the top. It does come up a little bit big. So like, if I was to show you, it's kind of like gapy. Like it's not tight, like the elastic isn't very tight. So it is a little bit, I hope you guys can see that. It is a little bit gapy like at the bottom. It doesn't really bother me that much because I think the extra room like kind of helped me in the chest area. So all in all, I really love this top. I think the color is just the prettiest sage green. And I'm gonna get so much good use out of this. I think with trousers, skirts, everything like that, I just think that it's, it's gonna look so cute this summer. The trousers, on the other hand, are a little bit lacklustre. I'm not quite sure if you can tell, but you can definitely see through them. I'm even wearing like nude underwear, and I feel like you can definitely kind of see through them. I think the fit is really nice. These are a 10. Um, I would say that they are long. Like, I would definitely have to wear heels to wear these outside. Currently wearing them with, like, my slippers on, and they are trailing on the ground i'm gonna get up here and show you guys in a minute but i just thought i'd show you just sort of down here what they look like so yeah this is what they look like fully and they are very very long they kind of like trail off my feet um 
And they are like, don't get me wrong, they are really, really comfortable. And I think the 10 fits really nicely as well. It's not tight at all. Like I've got lots of room. The waistband is nice and thick, but I just feel like they're just too, too see-through. They are that kind of, they are that sort of elastic, stretchy type material that can be a little bit cheap. And I just feel like if they were in a different material, maybe they would have been a little bit nicer, but you can definitely like, if you were wearing any other colour but nude underwear, you could definitely see it through them. Totally forgot to say, but the trousers were also £25. I've been waiting to film this outro for the last like half an hour because for some reason everyone in my uh, area is having construction work happening. So um, I just want to say, if you've never tried Oatly chocolate milk, oh my god, it's still going. Anyway, yeah, Oatly chocolate milk is like, oh my, it is just, ah. Uh, it is amazing. I'm filming, what's up? Just getting some water. Interrupting my filming. Do you want to be in my video? No. Come on. No. Come on. No. no. Yeah, just a small plug. Oatly milk. Shout out to Oatly milk because, my God, I live off oat milk in general, but I can't believe this is the first time I've ever tried Oatly chocolate milk. Game changer. Total game changer. Okay, so that's everything from quiz. What are my first impressions? Well, I do feel like the materials can be really hit and miss. Um, miss on the trousers. I feel like the second dress, the material was so-so, but the first dress and the co-ord, um, the material was amazing, really good high quality. This top, the material is sort of the same as in the, the dress and sort of similar to these trousers actually, but because of the way that it's cut and the way that it fits, I feel like for the price, $9.99, I feel like this is so worth the money. It looks so much more expensive than it is. Okay, so my favorite item has got to be the Lemon Cord. I was just absolutely blown away by the quality, the price, the way it looked, the way it fit. I would say all of the clothes fit perfectly in terms of sizing. I do feel like a 10 was a true 10 and a 12 was a true 12. Um, I'm also blown away by the quality of this top for the price as well. I do feel like they've got some really lovely styles, like the designs of the clothing are really, really well thought out. And they've been made really, really well in terms of the way that they fit the body. So I am like very wildly surprised and blown away by this try on experience. If I was to have done like a blind test, I would never have known that these pieces were from Quiz Clothing. So for that reason, I'm pleasantly surprised. I feel like I've been converted. I can't believe it's somewhere that I haven't shopped in like the past before because so many of the pieces are very me and they are fresh and they fit well. Blown away. You know what, I was also really, really shocked that I didn't know that they had a petite range, which is crazy because I felt like I knew all of the brands that had petite ranges. So I was really, really shocked that they have a petite range. I'm definitely gonna be checking out their petite range more often because I cannot believe that I didn't know they had one. And it is like a quite an extensive range. They have like a lot of different types of clothing in there. So I'll leave a link for everything down below in case you want to have a look at anything or shop anything. But um, yeah, I'm so surprised I didn't know they had a, a petite range. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.